only place I ever knew Willie was at the parking lot down at the Blue. He wandered through cars with his cane and guitar, singing songs for quarters and brew. He knew a song about a crap game gambler, and he knew one about a pool hall shop. But you never heard the guitar played in your life till Willie played the boogie in the dark. Does anybody here remember my Willie of oh, the blue land of pure joint fame? He was a black blues king on a beat up 12 string. You probably don't remember his name. All the teenage boys used to tease him, stealing quarters out of his can. But he taught me how to crawl through the wall bash cannonball and made me a guitar man. Yes, he did. Now, Willie went blind in the 30s from a bad batch of bathtub gin. His songs were real hot and he was very near the top, but he never was the same again. I heard he traveled some with Big Bill Broomsy. I heard he played with a lead belly band. But he died in an alley in downtown Atlanta, just another no good colored man. I was an average product of my culture, a sort of avant-garde Ku Klux Klan. But I changed my position when I saw the conditions that society had laid on that man. He was a man of a hundred vices. He was a man born to die in sin. But he taught me the blues and he brought me the news that there's more to a man than his skin. So let me sing you one for old blind Willie of the blue land of beer joint fame. He was a black blues king on a beat up 12 string. You probably don't remember his name. Now all the teenage boys used to tease him, stealing quarters out of his can. But he taught me how to crawl through the wall, flash cannonball, and made me a guitar man.